Junior Eurovision is almost upon us, and we know that this year's theme is Share the Joy. But I still have so many more questions. Like, for example, what are the tunes going to be like? And also, have I found the perfect event to wear my sequined cape? But I'm not the only one who has questions. This year's entrant is Jordan Anthony, who's no stranger to performing. But what does it actually feel like to take the Junior Eurovision stage? Well, there's only one person who can answer that question, and her name is JL Wenner, 2018's Australian entrant for Junior Eurovision. So, what happened when JL and Jordan met? Well, check it out. JL, what a champion. I'm so excited to be here with you today. And um, obviously, you did so amazing in Thank Junior you. Eurovision. Yes, I'm so happy to be here again, and I'm so excited to answer all your questions. Awesome. When did it really hit you that you were going, you know, overseas to represent our country? I think it really hit me when I was actually on the plane, just yeah. getting ready to take off. That's when I was like, I'm actually like, I'm Australia's representative and yeah. I was so happy Crazy. and like just going to a different country, a whole new experience. Amazing. What did it feel like representing our country on, you know, an international stage? It felt so amazing. It was literally a dream country because I've always like imagined myself standing on a massive stage representing my country and for all the people that voted for me, it was just so, it's just a happy feeling. Were there any of the countries in particular you made really good friends with and if you did, which ones were they? There was a lot, like all of us were so close, but I'd have to say probably like there was Malta, there was Ireland, Georgia, there was so many, like yeah, I just made so, so many awesome. friends. Um, I heard that you hit the ground running when you got over there. How did you take care of yourself and your voice with everything crazy that was going on? I drank a lot of water mm. and I always warmed up before I went on stage. There was a lot of rehearsals and I had to like practice even for the rehearsals. Like I would eat really well before mm. the show and just everything they would do to keep your voice and your energy up. What are some vocal warm ups that you like to do before your performances? <laughs> Now, your song Champion, absolutely amazing song. What did that song in particular and the lyrics mean to you? I'm singing that song more like to other people, but mm. like when I sing it, I feel like I'm also singing it to myself because like it goes for me, it goes for everyone out there too. And I always talk on those lyrics in like my everyday life and I just, they encourage me so much. What has being part of Junior Eurovision meant to you as an artist? It meant the world to me just to represent my country and to sing on that stage in front of everyone. And it was actually my first like big event and my first time overseas, so there were so many new things I was trying. Like yeah. I was just so happy and I just felt so great. Now this one's kind of a personal one, you know, for me, if you had one piece of advice for me to be able to take to Poland this year, what would it be? Definitely have fun. Don't take it as like a competition. Yeah. When I went there, everyone was just so loving and like it was all like, we're all best friends, just hanging out. And I would say on stage, do not have a voice crack because I did that <laughs> so many times and it was the worst. Just yeah. look after your voice and I drink will. as much water as you can. I love it. Thanks so much. Now, before you go, I've got one little request. Your song last year, the East Sang Champion, I loved it so much, and I was wondering if we could do a little a cappella duet right here, right now. Yes, for sure. I reckon. Let's do it. And you can be anyone if you believe that you can overcome. Don't stop believing that you are enough. You can be a champion, be a champion, and you can go all the way. Stand in your courage and be bold and brave. Hey. <laughs> JL, that was so awesome, so much fun. What a vibe having a little sing. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for coming in and having a chat with me today. Well, thank you so much for having me and good luck. And I know you'll do amazing and you'll make so many new friends and you'll just have the time of your life. Thanks so much. Oh, those harmonies, literal chills. And you know what? The best thing about this song competition is seeing the friendships formed along the way. And speaking of, you can catch all the action right here on ABC Me on the 25th of November. And who knows?
You might even see this little number make an appearance. All right, I've got to go dust her off. I'll see you next time. Bye.